Hi, my name is Billy Turnbow from Cisco Tech. In this video, we're going to look at an HA failover in Cisco I'm in Presence and how we can recover. High availability or HA is a failure recovery feature in Cisco I'm in Presence that exists between two or more presence nodes in a cluster. If any presence node in HA mode has a situation where either a critical service is unable to start where the presence nodes in the cluster are unable to communicate over the network, you may receive an alert. If you go to the notifications page, you will see that an automatic failover has been initiated. You may also notice from the presence topology page that you have a red X. If you hover over the red X icon in the presence topology page, you can see that high availability is in a failed state However, you may notice that all other services are green and in a good state. This means that either a critical service restarted or the present servers in the cluster failed to communicate for a while. If you don't see any services in a red X state, then you can check the system status of the servers by using the command utils diagnose test in a command line interface. If you find all services are running and there are no errors from utils diagnose test, you can simply recover your HA failover with a few simple steps. First, go to Cisco Unified CM Administrator user interface on your browser and log in. Go to the system menu and choose the presence redundancy groups. Select the default cup subcluster or the chosen name of the presence redundancy group configuration. And from here we can see the state of high availability. Assuming that both servers are actually working fine, you will see a failed over service state and another that is running in backup mode. The server showing failed over is the node in which the failover occurred. To the right of the server state, the reason for the failover shows up. In this case, we see that a critical service down caused the failover to occur. Since I have checked the services and I see that all services are in a green status, I can conclude that it should be safe to issue a fallback for high availability. Depending on the version of presence, this might also say recover. The presence cluster can be recovered from a failover at any time. Please note, however, that it will cause Jabber users to go into an offline state while they are being switched back over to the node they were originally assigned. Once they have been successfully reassigned, all presence and instant message features will return without requiring Jabber to log in. Let's click the fallback button now to recover from this failover. You will see the status update as this progresses and eventually the status will return to normal. Check this again from the presence topology page on presence administration. You should see that the topology is once again in a healthy green status. If you would like to find out the root cause for a failover, or if you see that there are down critical services that keep you from recovering from a failover, you can open a TAC case for further exploration. Failovers can occur for various reasons, but by default these will never recover automatically unless an administrator manually submits the fallback from the presence redundancy page. I hope this video was helpful. Thank you for watching.